Hello and welcome to another episode of All About Animals. Today we will be learning all about flamingos. Flamingos can be found in estuaries, lakes, either saline or alkaline, mud flats, and lagoons. They live in the Americas, Africa, Europe, and Asia. They eat algae, seeds, shrimp, snails, and plankton. They must be on the lookout for big cats like lions, leopards, and cheetahs. They live up to 50 years, range in height from 4 to 5 feet, weigh between 5 and 10 pounds, that's because they have hollow bones, so they're actually lighter than they look. They can be the color pink, red, and or orange. They have some adaptations that help them survive. They have special glands found next to their beaks, which help them excrete the excess salt water from their bodies. Too much salt? Not good. Broad web feet help them stand on incredibly soft and muddy surfaces, so they have great balance. They have long tubular necks that help enable them to catch prey even in deeper waters. Their long legs help them maintain balance, stay dry, and stir up mud for the food they're looking for. And they actually have very unique beaks. I don't know if you know this, but flamingos turn their heads upside down when they eat. Additionally, their jaws are kind of like the opposite of ours, where their top jaw moves and their bottom jaw is fixed. They also have some bristle-like structures in their mouth that help filter through impurities so they get rid of all the stuff they don't want to eat and gobble up the goodies that they do. Let's talk about some fascinating facts about flamingos. Did you know their color and brightness depends on what they eat? So when they eat shrimp and things like that, they actually turn pinkish. Pretty cool, right? A group of flamingos is called a flamboyance, and these groups range from 50 birds to thousands of birds. Their name means flame-colored, which comes from the Spanish or Portuguese language and is a reference to their pink-reddish feathers. They can run on water. They're actually picking up speed while running on water. And once they get to an adequate pace, they'll lift off and soar to greater heights. Many people don't know that flamingos can fly because when you see them in zoos, their wings are usually clipped. The flamingo is the national bird of the country, the Bahamas. They have a lot of them there. And for a bonus fact, when they are born, flamingo chicks are gray or white. They will gradually develop color in the first couple of years. Remember, the color they get is based on what they eat. Well, I hope you had a great time learning all about flamingos with me. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And if you want to learn about an animal, just drop a comment. Thanks and bye.